How to add or subtract polynomials. What do you get when you add two cats and three dogs? Let me think. Hmm, five cat dogs? No, right? Because the cats continue to be cats and the dogs continue to be dogs. I mean, you may have five pets, but you still have two cats and three dogs. Now, we can apply this same principle when we add polynomials. Because what property do we use when we add things? Yes, we add things with the same name. Consider this. If Julie has three cats and one dog, and Jeremy has one cat and two dogs, what can you say about their combined number of cats and dogs? Well, let's use C for cats and D for dogs. So, Julia, Julia has three cats, let's say three C, and one dog. Let's write one D. And we want to combine them. So, combine means we have to add them. We're going to add the number of pets that Julia has with... Uh, the dogs and cats that Jeremy has. Um, this he Jeremy has one cat, so we'll see one C, and two dogs plus two D. Now, when we add this, we know that combine they have four cats, four C, and that they have three dogs altogether. We are adding things with the same name, cats with cats, C's with C's, and dogs with dogs, D's with D's. Now, of course, we didn't need to write this one here or here, but we wrote it just for clarification. Now, let's look at subtraction. What if two cats and one dog from their combined number of pets die? What could we say about their combined number of cats and dogs. We have four cats all together, Julia and Jeremy, they have four cats and they have three dogs. And we want to subtract those that will die. So, one, two cats will die and one dog will die. Now, we know that if we had four cats and two dies, we're going to end we're going to end up with two cats and then if we had three dogs and one dies, we're going to end up with two dogs. But notice that in order for this to happen, you know, we are subtracting this guy from C and this guy from D. So this is just 4C plus 3D minus 2C minus, right, we're distributing that uh, minus sign, minus D. And now we combine like terms, 4C minus 2C plus 3D minus D is equal to uh, 2C plus 2D, which is exactly this.